Okay, this is a video to help you all see what we have available in the shop while we're under No shoppers allowed in the stores unless if they're food or hardware or car parts. I guess they don't think that people who practice different religions need a store that they can go to. But I am offering a service of curbside. So if you see anything in these videos, please just let me know. Message me, text me on my private phone number or my husband's and we will be happy to come down here and yes we are still taking cash with all the exposed surfaces I just can't keep everybody 100% safe unless if I just keep everybody out and I'm the only one in here accessing it so we are clean. None of us have had any symptoms. We want to keep it that way so we can help you guys. Monkey photo holder. Very cute. We do have herbs and teas to help with the immune system. We also have white sage smudge sticks laced some half of them are plain half of them have dragon's blood which smells really good because i know some people can't stand the smell of straight up sage oh. yes it is a medical freaks oddities book up on the top shelf that way the little kids can't reach it because there's some stuff in there they should not be seeing So if you guys need reading material, just let me know. And we do take cards. And if you don't want to let me handle your card, no problem. I can send invoices. And it's all secured. I use Square. I only have, like I said before, three items on my website, but I am working on that. It's like trying to start dishes, though. It's not one of my favorite things, but something that I absolutely have to do. Glad I didn't put my winter hats away. They're talking about going down in the 30s and 40s again. <sighs> okay. Hopefully all this will clear up and we can... Mr. Monkey still needs a home. Beautiful trifold mirror. Of course, clothes are going to be a hard mess if you guys can come in, but hopefully by April 14th I can reopen again. And if not, I'm going to follow safety protocol and keep us and everybody else safe. I do have Mullen. I do have angelica root, I do have nettle, lemon balm, catnip organic, lavender buds fresh in, I do have some rosemary, pine rosin, frankincense, dried chrysanthemum buds, rose buds, jasmine buds, chocolate peppermint, peach tree leaves, bone set, and there is the Plain sage. I have two of those left, and then I have a ton with the dragon's blood. I do have some Apache tears. I have some smoky crystal. These came out of a cave. There's a split open geode. I've got both pieces. I've got ear candles in case any of you with all those stupid allergies going on. They're only a dollar a pack. I've got my stones. I've got some fresh rose quartz in that I showed you. I have some geranium oil and one yang yang left. I do have some ginseng product up here. Some geranium root. And let's see what else do I have. Let's go over here. Go to the center. Of course, my... 
I've got a lot of my jewelry packaged up in new displays. Now I have to find a new display to show everybody because you can't really see. Tea bag holders. They're a dollar. Crocheted items. Fascinator hats. Okay. I do have some altar stones available still. Three dollars and two dollars. I have some bath bombs. Some of my daughter's soaps. Um, they are glycerin and they do have honey in them. And that's how come they're crystallized, is the honey is crystallized. So there's sour wood honey in these soaps. And then I have my sewing wax in. Uh, three ounce cakes, six dollars each. Nice. Made by a company who uses solar panels. So environmentally friendly. Then I have my oddities. Back there's an African bone bowl holder. And then there is an opium pipe made out of a llama bone. Some cat drawings that I did. Little owls. We still have some winter items out still. Brass. Cedar boxes. One of two weeping angels. We have um, trilobites. And then the Cherokee candles. This is Cherokee Autumn. Smells wonderful. Made by Walking Bear, and I'll give paper to anybody who buys those. It explains all about the crafter. And this is oops, the Sacred Herbs of the Cherokee. And they smell good. I got some bigger trilobites there. Some more African statuary. My dragon candles. Of course, Annabelle Mast's school children, and I have another one that's about ready. She is a mermaid that's caught in a fishing net, and then I'll be working on Slender Man. And then another girl who had a serious accident and lost half of her head, so these are just element stones. There's some with me anything. And then we have sage. We've got the huge three foot, no, that's two foot, two foot white sage sticks. I have this, the stick holders. I've got little individual ones where the boxes got damaged, but these have not been used. I have my own personal plastic wrappers that I rewrap them with. So I have myrrh, sandalwood, um, whatever that is. And then I have pine cone. These are the 50 cent ones because these, these are small ones. Dragon's blood, passion fruit, white sage, dra uh, pine cone, and that one. I also have Lobane, Call of Money, and then I have these, which has got Citronella, Paul Santo, Dragon's Blood, Frankincense, Traditional, whatever, Karma, uh, Positive Vibes, Namaste. Oh, these smell so good. I opened up the box and I about died. Nag Champ, um, Vanilla. Jasmine, Rosemary, oh, what is that one? Patchouli, one patchouli left. Um, Paul Santo, another one of those. One white sage of these. Oud. Oh, they smell so good. Spiritual healing. Meditation. 
Mm, okay, myrrh in this brand. Rose. Oh, rose is so good. I think this is lavender. Yep, lavender. Okay, back in there. And sandalwood in this brand. Okay, so if you need any of those, those are these are a dollar box. These are a dollar. These are 50 cents. These are a dollar. These are three dollars. And then I have Frankincense and Dragon's Blood and Cone. I have White Sage and Cone. White Sage down here also. And I have Dragon's Blood and Cone. So. And these are tarot cards that I've turned into uh, bookmarks. So if y'all need one, let's just give me a shout. I've got some pendulums. And some crystal boards. And then I have some polymer clay dragons, some war bones, teeth, then some fossils. Then my other friend makes bars of soap. That's hers. She also has a website online. She also does lip balms and body washes. And I have a few of her products here too. So if you can't make it all the way to South Knoxville where she's at, you can always... Um, you can either contact her or you can um, just tell me what you want and I'll see if I have it. And if I do, I can help you. Then I've got my two bags that I made. And then we have a new outfit on the new doll. Doll's not for sale, but the outfit, mask, and these little things are. Juggling octopus. Belly dancing outfits, great way to time, great time to learn how to belly dance. Cooped up in the house. I've got some anime t-shirts. Anime bags. My Edgar Allan Poe Lenore with the raven inside there. And we can't see it. Let me turn it on. There you go. You can see the raven. It's sitting on the raven. Well, it's not. It's just a prop. And then the black cat and the telltale heart. But it's really cool. And we have tons of comics. Great reading material for the kids. And then we have this outfit. And of course, we've got all these paintings and dream catchers and masks up there. And then there's paintings and drawings up there. I'm going to show you the back of the Call of Duty Black Ops hat. They have the insane posse. I think it's called the insane posse. If I said it wrong, I am so sorry. I apologize. We have Pokemon Old School and Yu-Gi-Oh! Old School cards. You just have a lot of stuff. So if you see anything, you have more questions about anything, we've got pop vinyls, we have anime, more drawings, more artwork, more artwork, a couple of classics. And then over here, we have a ton of manga magazines, manga DVDs, and regular DVDs. We have VHSs, we have sci-fi, we have all kinds of spirituality, we have Wicca, more paintings, artwork. Manga galore. Usually they're four dollars. Some of them are marked two dollars. Some of them are five. Some of them are six. Some of them can go for as much as 20 if they're sealed or first editions. Here's the other Weeping Angel inside the clock, which by the way is still available because I haven't had time to take it apart yet. We do have our Raymond drinks, and we still have Pocky. I skipped that counter. I'll have to go back to that. We have coffee, iced coffee drinks. Then we have more books. No more 
of the self-help cookbooks or whatever. This is all like romance, educational, classics, studies. And all this is VHS up here. And we have some more books. And we've got that shadow box. More books. And then we have this homeschool books down on the bottom shelf. And then we've got our little Jamaican bunny rabbit. And then a bodice... I painted and then we have my hangman's tree and then we've got a boar's butt and a deer head and then I've got another bodice up there that I painted and then we have this shirt we have those items in that case and the case itself all sold separately and then we'll go over here and then we have fairy dust some more jewelry. This is my newest one, and I love it. And it's Morse code. And yes, it is, says what it thinks you think it says. So I've got hairpins up here and a few bracelets right now, but I'm going to be putting more items up there. We've got squishies, chopsticks, pocky, our rack full of buttons. And right now I have sigils. For to help fight sickness, prevent disease and illness, and this one is to ward off sickness and promote good health. And they're all nicely done with silver. And we have these down here. So if you've seen anything, you have questions about anything, price, about prices, size, if I'll hold it back, I will hold items without a down payment for, well, I have to hold it for a month now. Um, with a down payment, I can hold it. My daughter did that. I can hold it for up to six weeks and then it goes back on the shelf and depending on the amount paid for the deposit depending on not a refund is going to be given like if you only put a dollar down on it yeah you're not going to get the refund back <laughs> because I would have had to store it and not sell it but if you like pay half, then yeah, you'll get your money back if you don't come in. Okay. And don't forget, we still are in the contest until April 30th to name this guy. He's the new store mascot that goes along with the Grim in the front window, and he needs a name too. And the winner of the name for this guy, April 30th, will be announced of course April 30th at 6 p.m. and they will receive a $10 gift certificate so you have to go to either the Instagram or Facebook or you can just message me and then we will go ahead and get you entered in so I guess until then I'm not going to show my face because I have no makeup on whatsoever but we will see you later and take care stay safe guys and my daughter did that witch picture in the back. I love it. But until then, let's go.